It feels solid to us, but it's only a fragile barrier, an apple skin around a flaming behemoth. True apocalypses can break through and unleash eruptions tens of times more powerful than all of our nuclear weapons combined, subjecting the climate to centuries worth of change in a single year, while drowning continents in toxic ash and gases. Supervolcanoes. How big can they get? And will they put an end to humanity? Volcanoes. There are many types of volcanoes, from towering mountains to lava domes, but they have two main sources. The first is at the boundaries between tectonic plates, the pieces of the crust that cover the Earth like a giant jigsaw puzzle. There are seven major tectonic plates and dozens of smaller ones, drifting against each other at up to 15 centimeters per year. This sounds slow, but on geological timescales, it is a titanic struggle over who gets to stay on the surface. The winning plate crumples into a new mountain range, while the loser is shoved underneath into an ocean of hot rock at 1,300 degrees Celsius, the asthenosphere. 